January 11, 2019 Dean Drobot, Shutterstock Jonathan Rivera and Fernanda Flores quickly captured the hearts of viewers with their sweet yet tumultuous love story while appearing on season 6 of TLC's hit reality drama series 90 Day Fiancé. However, it seems that the couple's relationship didn't last too long after the season ended. Earlier this week, the 32-year-old Jonathan Rivera confirmed his split from Flores, and opened up about his feelings regarding their separation, according to a report from In Touch Weekly. I haven't spoken to Fernanda since December 22, he told In Touch Weekly. I have a lot going on and so in the midst of all the craziness, I try to focus on what's important. Rivera did not go into details about what ultimately led to the demise of his marriage to Flores, but he did take the time to reiterate the legitimacy of his relationship, since 90 Day Fiancé is all about Americans bringing their international partners stateside, after a couple's unexpected breakup, it is a common assumption that the international partner may have had ulterior motives. My feelings for Fernando were real and Fernanda's feelings for me were real. Fernanda's not a gold digger. Fernanda didn't come here for a green card, he continued. The reality star said he gave the relationship everything he had but what happened was things change, things change and people change. He hinted that the couple's significant age difference may have played a role in their breakup. She's young. 20 years old. You have a tendency to continue to grow, you want different things as time goes on and I can't blame her for that, he noted. Rivera went on to say that he still hopes Flores will find happiness, and accomplish her goals. According to a report from E! News, it seems that Flores isn't quite ready to dish on her relationship just yet. I don't want to talk about anything about Jonathan again. Please don't ask questions about him, she told fans via Instagram. He's talking a lot, he can say whatever he wants. The pair met during Rivera's vacation to Mexico, their connection was undeniable, and the North Carolina native quickly proposed to the Mexican bombshell. After Flory's K-1 visa was approved, she moved to the United States to be with her beau, but throughout the season. The couple struggled to make it work. It seems that Rivera and Flores aren't the only 90 day fiancé couple currently dealing with relationship issues. As previously reported by the Inquisitor, Colt Johnson and Larissa dos Santos Liner recently got into a massive fight after Johnson purchased several pornographic videos from adult entertainment company ManyVids. Ashley Martin and Jamaican born Jay Smith also sparked breakup rumors after it was discovered that Smith had been cheating on Martin via dating apps hours after returning from their Vegas wedding, the Inquisitor also reported. However, despite the drama, it's unclear whether either of these couples will also decide to officially call it quits. As for Rivera, the TV star said that, he is excited about growing his business in 2019, and that he has been leaning on family and friends for support during this difficult time. 